a little bit. Yeah. Okay, Masada has to do with uh, all of this big uprise in Jerusalem in 66 to 70, and a group of, uh, of zealots that were up here on the mountain and uh, living their own life, and after about three years, the whole of the Roman army comes down here to take them down off the mountain. Uh, later on, I'll connect it to other things that uh, it has to do with today. Uh, the state of Israel and, and other things, obviously the effect that the Masada has, we can feel it until today. Um, over here, they have a, a drawing of Masada on its last day. Um, you can see the mountain, you can see the wall surrounding it. On the, on the mountain, you can see the Roman ramp and their battery ramp that broke through with fire onto the mountain. The Jews obviously were uh, were on the mountain, and the Roman Empire, the Roman army, was all around. You can see all of the siege wall going all around the mountain and down there as well. We, by this move, by this picture, would be down at that last, between those two last cubes over there, which is the two Roman camps. And at the distance over there, you can see the oasis of Ein Gedi. This is what we'll see from when we're up on the mountain. All of this area over here, they made uh, oh. uh, more dedicated to the archaeologists that came and dug around here. 